Fujino. Uh, that's not a bad way to start out. Love. Well, Rick, the serves are going to play an important part in this match for both players because Sloan Stevens also going to have to get a high percentage of first serves to stop Williams from attacking. She's not messing around, 118 Here's miles per hour. Is that the put away or the serve? <laughs> <laughs> Good question. That was the serve. The put away might have been even faster. Now the breeze has picked up as it often does late in the afternoons here at the open. Strong start for the defending champion. First game. Oh, Serena, such a great champion, such a great competitor. She does a lot, too, for the youth. I know some of the girls that I'm coaching, she has really spent a lot of time talking with them and mentoring them, and it's meant so much to those young players. And for me as a coach and as a former player, it has meant a lot to me. That's something I'd like to get into with you uh, as the match progresses because obviously a showcase of women's tennis, the top two ranked women going head to head here. Kathy, your uh, continued involvement in helping these young girls develop. play by Stevens and that's what she wants to try and do. She can't get into the defensive position too often. She has to play offense today. Is that kind of the tendency with her because she's so good from the baseline? Well, we saw that in the first round and she's really stepped it up the next couple of rounds. Had a terrific match on Ash under the lights. And that's what Serena's going to do. She's going to punish that second serve. 15 over. She stands inside that baseline, takes it early. Just so powerful off both the forehand and backhand. That wasn't a weak second serve either at 98 miles an hour. Nearly 160 kilometers per hour. Serena's serve obviously in another world compared to uh, just about every other woman on the tour. But as far as Sloan's concerned, can she can she hurt Serena with a serve? Absolutely. Her serve can be a big weapon. She's got a very live arm. Big athlete. Oh, there you go. There's some power. On display right there. Two game points. 14-15. Time stepping in on her forehand. That's well behind the baseline. Still a game point. That's 
what Serena does. She really, you feel her presence when returning. She can talk her opponent into some double faults. this crowd really wanting to get into this match early on. The power of Sloan Stevens drawing oohs and ahs. A couple of shots in that rally. Best early on. And that's exactly what Stevens wants to do. She wants to keep the rallies a little bit longer and make Serena feel like she's got to force her way in, Stevens. make something happen. Great angle. Great defense. Pointed. Yeah, that had to be close to 30 strokes on that rally. Holds that was a 23 stroke rally. It was close. It was within 10. <laughs> Should point out that uh, the extreme heat weather policy here at the Open is uh, enforced in all the women's singles and junior matches beginning after 1 o'clock today. We talked about uh, the temperature Fahrenheit close to mid 80s, a little under 30 degrees Celsius. You can see that breeze, but that, uh, that can fool you. You also have humidity to it's deal with. It's extremely humid outside. Fifty-nine. And Kathy, that means that uh, before a third set, we would could get a break if either. Uh, they get a ten-minute break if both players or one of the players requests. We'll see how things develop. The effect of the weather conditions. Looks like we're in for a long one. The way this is starting. Well, this is where Serena is a step above everybody else because she wins so many free points off her serve. Really in a league of her own, I should say. Serve has been a major weapon for her. Forehands. Serena would appear on her way to a comfortable hold. Well, if you're going to double fault, 
Better to be up 40 love. Never a good time for it, but uh, you can get away with it there maybe. Especially when you possess a serve like Serena. for Serena, her second of the match so far on serve. Serena 2-1. Stevens trying to keep pace with the great Serena Williams on serve early on. Biggest serve's been 118 so far, and Serena with that ace to finish off her last game at 122. Wow. That'll bring up the heat index down there for <laughs> Ash Stadium. Fifteen. Well, it's the percentage of first serves that Sloan Stevens needs, and she's won every point it's early yet, but every point on her first serve under a lot of pressure from the Serena Williams return. Oh. 30, 15. Kathy, we were talking about uh, this being a battle of the two highest ranked women on the tour. Ten American women in the top 100 more than any other country. That's something that uh, you have to be proud of. And is it more of a concerted effort in terms of the younger women working together more than maybe you can? That's just too good from Serena Williams. And Rick, you know, when one young player sees another young player doing something, it becomes a healthy competition. Well, if she can do it, so can I. And then, you know, they're motivated to go out and work harder. And I think that's what we're seeing. And they do, they practice together. A lot of them are very good friends off the court and really pushing each other to that next level. Well done by Stevens to erase the break point. Sybil Stevens, Sloan's mother, on the left. Father John Stevens, former NFL running back, passed away a few years ago. Played for the Patriots. Another break point for Serena yes. and her mom, an excellent swimmer. That's David Nankins, a USTA national coach that works with Sloan Stevens out in Carson, California. Been very instrumental in her success. has just been lethal. A thundering forehand with a great angle. Back to Deuce. Deuce. Does a great job getting around this with her feet and then inside out, finds the corner and angles it off the court. Both these women have demonstrated they've uh, you know how to finish points with gusto. <laughs> Again, 
and the longer the rally goes, the more success Stevens is having. two American women meeting here. Allison Risk also making it through another American. Oh, what a great round. story. What a sweet girl. Oh, well, she got up there with no problem. Just that ball dipped so low. She felt Serena closing the net. Basically, when this ball gets that low below the net, got to hit up on it. Not an easy task when you see Serena Williams standing, <laughs> standing right there. Great serve by Stevens. Another game point here. Stevens with 19 miles per hour. Fans of, oh, let's watch this serve again. Finding the corners. Fans of American tennis might say it's too bad that one woman's going to lose here, won't be able to go on. The Italians can say the same thing. They just keep yep. bumping into it's each the other. The draw. And there's many quality players from that country in the draw. No, she's got to do something with that second serve. And that's that's the pressure that Serena puts on you. And so far in these first first four opening games, it's Serena who's holding a lot easier than Sloan. Second double fault for Stevens. Ah! My advantage, Stevens. Follows it up. Right back. Had a couple of long games early on. This one closing in in seven minutes. We saw in that opening match a lot more airs off the backhand wing of Sloan Stevens. Double. Two in this game, handing Serena another break point chance, number three. Missed return from Williams. Players under a lot of pressure. This stadium is packed. Serena has to be a little bit patient because Sloan is so quick around the court and plays such great defense. She's going to make her play that extra shot. It was against a lot of other players. That, a lot of these balls would be winners. And to Stevens holds. Two all here in the first set. Fans enjoying this action. They're going to be here a while, it would appear. Well, you can certainly stay connected to the U.S. Open through all your favorite social media platforms, including Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Google+, and more. Visit usopen.org for more information. Saw an item where during that upset over Serena at the Australian Open, Sloan Stevens. 
enjoys conversing with folks on Twitter. Her followers <laughs> more than doubled during that match. You can imagine where they are now. <laughs> that was back in January. Yeah, and after she won, I saw her go straight to her phone. on. T I was home on TV going to look. She was talking about her followers. That's another big serve. That time into the body, jamming Stevens. As we saw before the match began, Serena's dropped only eight games in six sets. But uh, I guess maybe the only challenge was her last match. She started at 11.30 at night. <laughs> she said yesterday, after she and Venus won a doubles match to get into the uh, fourth round of women's doubles, she finally got to sleep around 5.30. <laughs> Oh, Might be a little sleep deprived still. Well, as you said, she's only dropped very few games. Well, she's had more winners than unforced air in every match. And if she can keep that ratio up, she's going to be tough. Love for Serena. Williams needs to get champ. Pieces. Leading 3 2 on serve. Opening set, fourth round match. Sloan Stevens to serve. Going to keep us on pace here. A match that has featured a lot of long rallies and uh, several long games. Must add that the long rallies and the long games are coming on the Sloan Stevens service games. Yes, Serena's had three chances to break and has not been able to get it done so far. Fifteen. I'm sure, you notice that uh, you don't hear a peep out of. Sloane Stevens during any of her shots. Uh, she even admitted that Serena told her earlier in the year she needed to grunt more, <laughs> make a little more noise. Just sailing long. It'll be interesting to see if we hear any come ons. Yes. After that controversy in Brisbane. Stevens in trouble again, a little bit here on her serve. The right play just didn't get up to that volley quick enough. Had a good serve and a big forehand here. Just a little hesitation. I think she was considering taking that off the bounce. I th yes, I think she, she just read it a little too late. Game Williams. There's a come on from Serena Williams. Big first, return. First one of the day as uh, it's the first break of serve of the day. And Serena looking to make a move here in this first set. These girls are pretty good friends off the court. And it's tough when you're playing somebody that 
that you know well, and Serena's you know helped mentor her a little bit as she's come up. Sloan Stevens, and when you're out here, your competitors. You want to silence yourself. Even on Sloan's serve, we've noticed a couple of times where she could have come in. Is she staying back? Is that just kind of a natural thing she needs to work through, or is she just respecting the power of Serena? It's natural. Her natural position is defense. She has gotten more offensive through the years. I believe that's one reason why she has had her breakthrough. She can play both now. Serve was called good, would be Serena's third ace. Sloan's challenging the call. It was close. And it was out. The young eyes win. <laughs> Second serve for Williams. Motion from Sloan, and you might construe that as being timid in this matchup. Uh, but that's she's not always the case. like that. She's just keeping her emotions <laughs> under control. <laughs> she used to be a little bit more emotional on court, especially in the juniors. She's done a great job of managing those emotions. Big shot. That's from well behind the baseline. Not much you can do with this. Pure power. Right off the baseline. Terrific play again from Stevens, that time getting on top of the point, dictating play. To be honest, you're better off giving That's Stevens a volley, a very live arm, very solid overhead. Called on Serena. Bears watching. She didn't react real well to uh, having one <laughs> called on her in doubles yesterday. Well, we won't Is talk about the one a few years ago either. But a real opportunity here. First great point opportunity for Stevens. Crowd recognizing that. Situation with the uh, lines person yesterday. He reacted to it a couple of points later. Venus had to kind of haul her off before uh, she got a little too involved. Miss on a second serve there. And you and will a break see back Wilson. by Sloan Stevens. We're Please back on serve here in the first. Oh. 
forehand is on. Just such effortless power off the racket of Sloan Stevens. These women have shown the propensity to really get on a roll this year. Of course, Serena won 34 matches in a row that covered five titles, including the French Open. That's what Serena Williams does so well. She opens up the court. She uses the angles of the tennis court better than anyone. Is that something she's uh, developed as her career has gone along rather than just rely on power? Well, yeah, I mean, she, you know, young players, when they see her, they think she's just all about power, but she opens up the court and then uses her power. going for it there. Thought she could get to a break point situation. She's at 30 all. She's on the side of the court that the wind's behind. of big serves here where she's had the opportunity on that forehand. It's the right play, playing the right way. We need to come up with something here. Serena's had a number of break point chances. Thank you. There's no breathing room against Serena Williams because of the big serve and the big mm -hmm. returns. Always under pressure. Terrific playing by Sloan Stevens. Very calmly done. This time playing behind Serena. She was looking to the open court. Now she was able to step in behind that one. Advantage. That's the big first serve. This is why so many people think Sloan is the next big American player, because she has the weapons. Back to Deuce. Sloan got on a few rolls this year, starting out 10 and 2, including at a Nice appearance there at Brisbane, where Serena beat her in the quarters, and including the Australian Open, where Azarenka finally took her out in the semis. Advantage, Stevens. And she's got another game point here. She's currently on a 9-3 match run. It's taken her through a few of the events of the hardcourt season in the first three rounds of this event. So to extend it against Serena Williams. Big hold for Stevens. She's battling on her serve, but she's coming up, finding a way. And now pressure comes back over to Serena. When we last saw her serving, she double faulted Couple of points away to uh, give back the break. It was 30 all, and she double faulted the game away. Let's see how she responds. She's 
responding like a number one world player. She's got such a great wide serve on that deuce court. Nailed the corner. Third ace for her. Far and away the leader on the WTA Tour. She's got uh, 397 for the year, almost 400. Ah! Ah! leader in all statistics. <laughs> <laughs> I know if she wins this year's U.S. Open, she's going to have a big payday. <laughs> well, it's terrific movement from Serena Williams, showing that she can play a little defense, too. We're just not used to seeing her play much defense. Terrific angles. And this young lady. <laughs> Stevens will accept the call. Williams, Williams holds. 5-4 here in the first. For Serena Williams leading 5-4 late here in the first set. Kathy, you alluded to the big payday if she were to defend her crown as the women's champion here at the U.S. Open. Of course, Thank you. Right. grand prize, $2.6 million, and she won the Emirates Airlines U.S. Open Series on the women's side. That's just too good. On the run. And stretched out. Left of team. Oh. It's not about the money for Serena Williams no. anymore. It's about the titles. <laughs> no, but she'd get a million dollar bonus for having won that U.S. Open series. Yes. And winning the U.S. Open. And push her winnings over 50 million. <laughs> <laughs> Love the team. Closing in on this first set. Miss hit there by Stevens. Sloan's pocketed over a million dollars this year. Oh. Over 1.2 million. Aided by all these deep runs in the Grand Slam events. Much more coming her way. 15-13. That's your smart serve, kicking that out to the backhand, the two-handed backhand. That's not an easy serve to return. That was a good mix-up. She caught Serena a little off guard there. A break point chance for Williams. She's one of five so far, and this would be huge. As she has set point. He is looking on. Thank you.
Houston. A couple of big shots. From It'll Sloan come on there Stevens. from Sloan. Mm -hmm. Sending a little message back. She's been able to do a number of times here in this first set. Stevens showing toughness, hanging in there, getting things turned around. Trying to extend the rallies. Morrisine Williams, that's Serena's mother. Jill Smaller, her agent. sailing long but using that kick serve with the wind behind her extremely well giving her that shot it was wide open just a little too flat didn't have her feet behind the ball That point for Serena. She's been up against the wall on serve so often, Kathy. Well, how many times can she still keep pulling through on her own service game? She's been pressured every time. Thank you, ladies and Set point. Enough with that ball, Serena. It's just hanging right in the middle of the court, mid court. And on the forehand wing of Stevens. That's where all her winners are coming from, the forehand side. Stevens. That must be going through the mind of Serena Williams. Under so much pressure out here. The biggest stage. Almost 32 years old. A young up and coming American. It's tough enough playing a youngster, but someone from your own country. How many times is Stevens? Delivered a perfect serve down the tee <laughs> and has not been able to Capitalize, follow it up. Yeah. Yeah. She's had those opportunities. Serena can say the same thing. One of seven on break point chances. Yeah, absolutely. She's had points. chances almost in every service game. game on the wow. serve of Stevens. Third oh. try to close out this set for Williams. It's the 20th unforced air for Sloan Stevens with only nine winners.
Boy, please, thank you. It's wide, and Stevens Six games is broken again. The first set belongs to Serena Williams. Another Orisine pleased with the result there. Was she trying for too much with some of those shots as the set went along? Well, I or? think when you play against someone like Serena Williams, you, you always feel like you have to do more. For me, you know, Sloan, I think, is playing the right way. So you don't want her to stop playing that way. You have to go for it. But maybe just with a little bit more margin, with the wind behind you, maybe just a little bit more spin. Some of those balls were just sailing long. opening game here. Good opportunity for Sloan Stevens. All's not lost when you look back at how she beat Serena in Melbourne. She dropped the opening set there. So let's see how she responds. This is what Serena Williams has been able to do over the years, serve her way out of trouble more so than any other female player. Fourth ace. It's back even to 30 all. Waiting for the right time, waiting for her opportunity patiently. Right here, sees the opening, just laces this right up the line. <laughs> Not going away. That Serena at love 30. Just takes that forehand to another level. And it puts a little exclamation point on this one. Some happy fan will get to keep that ball. Some bad hands there in the stands behind <laughs> Serena. Looking for that wide serve. Thank you. Just 
Gutsy play from Serena Williams. To me, that's her most natural serve. Mm -hmm. Out wide on the deuce, up the tee, slides that ball up the tee on the add. Gets it over 100 miles an hour. Yeah. She desperately needed that facing her second break point of the match. And then a critical opening game of the second set. Advantage Williams. in. Deuce. Again, this ball gives Sloan plenty of time to get set inside out right in the corner. Every single one of her winners have been off the forehand. Oh, advantage. Williams. Serena going down the middle once again. Just so nice success. to have that big serve in your pocket, 123 miles per hour. The fastest has been 125. And she's into the wind. <laughs> Scary. the uh, one hour mark for this match. And Serena battles and holds for one love here in the second set. Erasing a uh, break point opportunity. Let's look at uh, the set one summary. Well, 65% first serves is terrific for, his, for Sloan Stevens, but it's the unforced errors that really hurt her in that opening set. More winners than unforced errors is always a great thing for Serena Williams. And the great champion Williams stepping up at crunch time late in that set to capture it 6-4. Great year Serena's having. And a lot of people look back to 2002 when she had the Serena Slam. Not all four titles in one calendar year carried over a little bit. But she followed that up with the, the knee injury, knee surgery. She's had a nice stretch of good health for the first time in a long time. Before. She says she's never felt better. 15, oh, extremely fit. Is just tremendous play, just pushing Stevens from corner to corner. Deputing accuracy, power. A point reminiscent of many we saw in the opening games of the match. So mentally tough.
she got that. Terrific pickup from Sloan Stevens. The half volley, not an easy shot. Terrific defense from Serena right here. That's a difficult shot right in no man's land. Serena moving like a teenager out there. She sure is. And Sloan coming in a bit more. Yes. Off the sideline. for Stevens, one all here in the second. One game, one second second. Impressively done. Some powerful hitting for both sides of the net there. Kathy Serena now working with Patrick Moritoglu. And we talked about increased fitness. She's benefiting from that. Is that one of the things that he's brought uh, to her game? to get her back to the top? I think so. And also, I think they've put a little bit more spin on her forehand. As it used to be a lot flatter. She's now using her hand a little bit more. Oh. You know? Well, he's uh, talked about to the media a little bit about improving her in-match focus a little bit where in the past she might drift a few games or something, but staying with it. She's done such a great job of staying focused. <laughs> Keeping a high level of play throughout the matches. Good right in the corner. Combination. Those are the combinations Serena likes. First serve, the first shot. That's a lot of points off this off her serve like that. Oh, She's got the big first serve. She's got the kick. Finishes it off. A hold at Love. On serve here in set number two. Serena in front, a set into one. Doesn't get any better than this on Labor Day weekend. U.S. Open. Packed crowds. American tradition. Great play from both players, in fact. An unbelievable return from Serena. Sloan able to get over there right here and chip this ball down low. Great pickup volley. And then just volleys it, just does what she has to. Fifteen over. 
pretty amazing what the Bryan brothers yes. have done with their career and going for the career calendar grand slam. Down a, they were down a set and a break. Things turned around yeah. basically on a challenge that went their way. Unbelievable. Terrific passing shot from Sloan Stevens. Didn't panic, stayed calm, picked her target and stuck with it. The forehand winner. stairs here and there that have been the difference. She's faced some heat on just about every service game. Faced eight break points. So good. Again, there's giving Serena a little dose of her own medicine. The serve out wide. Up the big forehand to the open court. That Serena's got a break point chance. Just wasn't able to get her out wide and make her reach on that return. Right in the strike zone. Serena, compact stroke. Again, finds the angle. the break in this second set. We'll serve at 3-1 up the set. Break. That was just terrific defense by Serena Williams making a stab there, anticipating the next shot well. Using the win to her advantage. <laughs> and Sloane Stevens with some uh, well-placed Four uh -huh. hands with a lot of steam Beautiful. on Beautiful. Kathy, you've talked about her uh, serve out wide to the deuce court, how effective it's been today, and she's also had uh, plenty of power to go with it. Legends. Well, the problem is if you kind of try to move over there and take that serve away, she's still got the one up the tee, as we've seen. on that ball. It's too good. Ah! Ah! 
She's really Thanks. dialed in now. Ready to make her move if she can. Looking to consolidate this break. Venus doesn't look too concerned. Pretty in pink. Finding the answers. Slum does a great job of covering this angle. Serena almost overruns that ball. Great example <laughs> of her ability to move now mm -hmm. and, and perfect balance to hit that yeah, shot. Yeah, a few years ago she wasn't moving quite as well. We saw the knee <laughs> bothering her. <laughs> gotten herself in tip-top shape. Ah! Oh. Game Williams. Well, Stevens Williams is going to have to come up with something up special second. now. Down a set and a break. Down 4-1 here. Well, the crowd entertained. Well, Battling for that souvenir, but yes. I think Sloan was. She needs to get something positive to happen here. Something new. The fans get to keep the ball. They don't have to throw it back in. Pressured on her serve again. seen Serena serve well, some winning returns, We've seen her defend well, seen her on the attack. We know there's nothing she can't do in this sport. And she now has a couple of break points here and just sheer consistency in matching the best that uh, Stevens can muster right now. Well, as Vina said, it's really her title to win. The only way she's not going to win it is if she defeats herself out there. Just been so mentally strong, focused. Relatively easy service break there for 5 1 for Serena. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a change of ends. Please remain in your seats. Thank you. Allison Hughes trying to get the folks to settle down here as. Sloan Stevens, just 20 years of age, pacing in the back of the court. I'm New balls for Serena to serve with. Trying to I close this match out. People are starting to file out. Thinking this match is, it's over. Sloan 
Stevens might try and have something to say about that. 59. Or the Serena Williams serve yeah. might have something to say about that. Then wow. again. Ace number six. Giving her an even 400 for the year. That's incredible. 121 miles an hour, right on the line. going Stevens way at this point. Serena two points away. Serena's just been too good today. Fourteen. And triple match point for the defending champion. That smile brings a that, that ace brings a smile to Venus's face because they're playing doubles together too. <laughs> Still in the mix there for another Grand Slam Thank title you. on the doubles side. So Thank close, you. Venus and Serena have been Thank so you. great for each other, so great for our sport. match taking on Carla Suarez Navarro who upset Angelique Kerber earlier today. Oh, that was close. I'm it's going to challenge this. Looked pretty good. It was called out. On match point. No. Second service. Not yet. Certainly was going for it, not holding back. 101 mile per hour second serve. One more match point. title able to move on to the quarterfinals defeating fellow American Sloan Stevens 6-4-6-1 Just terrific play from Serena Williams handling the pressure extremely well always difficult to play an up and coming country woman a lot of hype made of this match before the tournament even started. Once the draw came out, everybody was talking about this matchup. Pack Stadium and just handled herself extremely time, well. Sloan and for Sloane Stevens, what a future. She's already shown us. She's a reckon, a force to be reckoned with and just sky's the limit. Well, Serena's dropped only Ladies four matches all year five. long. So Onboard that match where she was beaten at the Australian Open, Open certainly going to stand out as uh, Sloane Stevens got to the better of her on that occasion. But they meet again here at the U.S. Open in the fourth round. And in straight sets, it's Serena moving on to face Carla Suarez Navarro, the 18th seed. Well, I don't think anybody can take Serena out if she continues this path. 
Thanks, Bill. Serena, this was a much anticipated fourth round match, a rematch of Australia's quarterfinal with Sloan. Did it feel like a bigger match to you? Yes, it definitely feels like a, a really big match because Sloan's such a great player. I mean, how excited are we for the future of um, American tennis, right? Um, yeah, it's, she's such a good player, so it definitely felt like something bigger, but I just had to stay focused for the moment. Well, the first set, you had a lot of long games early in the second as well, but then you broke away. What gave you the edge today? Um, I don't know. The whole time I just tried to do what I want, just stay calm and stay relaxed and have fun and just stay composed. And um, thank you guys for, <laughs> for cheering. I heard you. There's a lady over there that was cheering really hard, so thank you very much. You've been playing a lot of tennis the last few days, singles and doubles. You're back on the court with Venus, who was watching you today. How much is that helping you? transfer to your singles game, your doubles play? Oh man, I love playing doubles with Venus. We just have so much fun, um, especially playing here in New York is really a blast. So um, it's been great. It definitely can help my singles game. I definitely think my serve was able to do better because of the doubles and um, I look forward to, I think we play tomorrow. So your next opponent just finished, Suarez Navarro upset Kerber. What are your thoughts about playing the one-handed Spaniard? <laughs> It'll be a tough match, but I hope you guys come out and support me, yeah? Go USA! I think everybody here is going to be cheering you on, Serena. Well done today. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, guys.